Goody, what is up? This is Eddie Neddy, and welcome to the next episode of the Ipswich Town career mode and the final episode of season one. We're going to power through all nine games today in the championship. Well, actually, eight or nine. I'm not 100% sure what it is right now, but we begin with a home trip here against Coventry. Let's see how we do here against the Sky Blues. Okay, Davis. My best launch can stack here. It's Rich Leaf Davis just running at the Coventry defence and managed to beat the defence. Leaf Davis, chance for Ipswich, and he's buried it. It's been a really tight game here. 25 minutes gone, but we do lead against Coventry and a step closer to the Premier League. King it up, edge of the box, shot across goal. Good block, Wolf Eden. Turns his man O'Hare, loops a ball in. Ellis Sims for free header inside the six yard box. And Coventry are level just like that. 1 1. Burns just using his pace. Where's Burns now? Driving in. Go try and draw the ball across. Alahamadi's there. And to be honest, here, we really don't deserve this in terms of the intensity. Coventry have really tried to get at us. We've defended well, but we've gone back in front. 2 1. Alahamadi. Chance of a Coventry. Sim shoots across goal. Tickle with the save. Okay, we're trying to break up forward. Alahamadi. Alahamadi doing so well. The Iraq forward. We have a chance off the post. So close. Chance here for Coventry late on. Van Weck teeing it up. Sheaf well blocked. Coventry piling on the pressure in the final minute. Ball whipped in. Chest down from O'Hare. Block from Twanzabi and Luongo just gets rid of it. And that's full time. Wow, big pressure at the end. But we hold on. Big three points. Aim, another big one. Southampton away, away at St. Mary's. Going to be difficult. Loads of changes to the team. Let's see how we can do. Not oh, Sarmentino merely wins the ball off Southampton in defensively. Sarmentino cuts in, does so well. Sarmentino, what a start. A mistake from Southampton. And Sarmentino, who has been nothing short of phenomenal. Let's go. Hold our shape. I'm to try and dissect us and Sulemana. Wow, what an incredible finish. 1-1. One, one. Got Southampton all over us at the moment. Another shot and they've scored again. And it's that man again, Sulemana. I'm struggling to cope here against Southampton. 2-1 to the Saints. Hey, Hutchinson laying it behind. More shot across goal. Good save from Bazunu. Corner, Broadhead, more, two all. What a game at St. Mary's, 2-2. Two, two. Done ball over Tiger, try and find Broadhead. He brings the ball down, cuts in, Broadhead. Uh, it falls to Hutchinson. Good save, Bazunu. Just for half time, we got ourselves a late corner. Broadhead delivers that ball in. It's a more, who does it again? This is an incredible first half of football. 3-2 Ipswich. Hutchinson into Broadhead. Nathan Broadhead. Oh, just over the bar. Huge chance for 4-2. Oh, what a pass. Great effort. Great save. Tickle. There we go. Full time. Huge three points. Southampton. Not the most exciting second half, but we held out. 3-2 win. Next game here against Plymouth. No rest for the weary. Let's get into it. A lot of changes due to fitness issues. Let's see what we can do. We got ourselves a corner here. Burns delivers the ball in. Clark with the head off the post. So close. Burns. Shot from distance. Oh, another great save from Plymouth. Chance of a Plymouth. Oh, my Whitaker's completely free into the middle of the box. And slices it wide. It's a penalty. Penalty Ipswich. Soon we haven't had much in this series. Dan Scar gives it away. On Hutchinson. Yeah, it's a penalty. I wasn't sure on it initially. And it's going to be Hurst. Not the most confident of penalty takers. But we bury it. Won the Ipswich. And a step closer to the Premier League. There we go, full time. The penalty was enough to give us three points. Big win for Ipswich. Unfortunately, bad news. Cameron Humphreys has suffered a broken toe. 
and he'll be out for the rest of the season. So next game of the episode here is going to be played against Millwall uh, away from home. Let's see if we can try and win. Right now, just driving down the right side. Beats Wes Harding for pace. Clark does so well. Drills the ball across. Ah, cleared away in the middle. Lots of them just so well played. Broadhead in down the left side. Nathan Broadhead, has he got the pace? He has. Play across to Moore. On one more. Blocked. Chance here. Tyler Goodenham with the effort. And his first goal as an Ipswich Town player. A great finish. Won the Ipswich against Millwall. Free kick here. Edge of the box. I think they're going to dink a ball in. Not a bad delivery header from Millwall. And Millwall a level. 1-1. Marcus Harness cuts in. Might be able to do to an ear harness. Uh, wait, falls Tyler Goodram. Who lays it off. Shot taken and just wide. Wes Burns. Give away the ball. Millwall are in. And Millwall have scored. Nisbet. 2 on Millwall. And see for Ipswich and Luco plays a great ball through to Alahamadi. Alahamadi's in. Alahamadi. Wow. 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 Full time. We lose 2 1. But Alahamadi at the end. So I've got some good news and some bad news. The good news is we are officially now a Premier League club, so we can start planning for next season. So happy about that. Ipswich in the Premier League. The bad news is, unfortunately, I'm recording this the next day, um, the game corrupted for both Hull and Birmingham. Uh, so we ended up winning the game 3-2 at Birmingham and 2-1 against Hull. Uh, Birmingham took the lead very early on. I believe Sariki Dembele scored, then we levelled it. Then uh, we went in front and then they levelled it. And then we managed to score late on again. I believe with George Hurst at the end, I think. Uh, it was over Hurst or more. And the whole game as well, uh, we managed to go in front. Then we managed to get another. But Hull pulled one back for a penalty, I believe. Um, I can't remember who took the penalty. I want to say it was too fat. Just a random guess. But anyway, we're going to get into the live commentary between the Swansea, QPR and Leicester games. Okay, hello everybody, welcome to the Ipswich career mode. Anyway, I'm welcoming you live anyway. Uh, after all them post-commentary games, sorry about the Birmingham and Hall game. My apologies, I just went on and for some reason Streamlabs recorded them and then they ended it mid-session. Hopefully, doesn't happen here. But anyway, we're going to get in the game here against Swansea. Fingers crossed we can manage to pull a result out of the bag. Um, obviously, we're promoted to the Premier League. However, we haven't secured the league title and I want to get over 100 points. That is obviously ideal. Let's take on um, a decent Swansea side. It's into Kifo Moore. The former Cardiff striker forces a good save from the keeper. Half time, nil nil. Not the most exciting first half, but it doesn't need to be. Chancey, uh, Ginnelly, and Swansea leads. Wow. Swansea trying to stop us winning the league. 1 0 Swansea. Got two changes here. It's going to be Caden Jackson. Oh no. Uh, yeah, Caden Jackson Burns come on. And it is uh, being replaced by Harness and Goodram. Oh, Burns does so well. Where's Burns? Oh, Burns. Oh, Burns still going. Does so well here, Burns. Needs an option. Drills the ball across. Open net. And does go in off the defender. And of course, it had to be the former Cardiff man, Keith O'Moore. 1-1. One, one. Travis. Jackson. Lewis Travis. Travis. Oh! 2-1 Ipswich. What a finish. Come on. What a finish from Lewis Travis. Well, I believe that might be his first goal for us. And that could potentially win us the league title. What a finish there from Lewis Travis. Transabi not in the most familiar position here for the former United centre-back. Does, but does win us a corner. 
Can we get anything from this corner? Samentino, ball whipped in. More! Haunts his former rivals. 3-1 Ipswich. Full time, 3-1 Ipswich. A big, huge win. A fantastic win here for the team. We're going to the next game against Queen's Park Rangers. We're now playing against already relegated side QPR. A chance to win the league today with a win. Or even a point, I believe, would win us the league. But if we fail to win, you know, if we, I mean, if we lose and Norwich win, the league title race is back on. We've got to be at our best again. Whipped in, headed away, and Frey has launched on it. And QPR have scored. It's 1-0 QPR, already relegated side. Are leading against the league leaders. Chance of a QPR. Frey shot just wide. QPR almost 2-0 in front. Half time, 1-0 QPR, but... A bit more of a concerning thing, but luckily, obviously, it is the end of the season. Broadhead has suffered an injury, so that is not great. Do you know what? We're going to bring on Sonny Aluko. I know he probably hasn't got the pace or the ability now, but it is his final, you know. He's retiring at the end of the season, and we'll give him one good send-off. <laughs> Samantino Aluko has got some great space here down the left side. Provides a good ball into Moore, who kind of had to score there. It's another save from Megovic. Another corner, Samantino, ball in, more! He's been so good from corners this season. One all. Hollow chance, shot blocked. QPR, come close. QPR now putting on some pressure. Challenge. Hutchinson plays in a Luco. What a fitting farewell this could be! Sonny Aluko, what a fitting farewell this could be. Could you get a better retirement story? He could potentially won it, switch the league. Oh, Aluko. Oh, Aluko. Oh, my days. Sonny Aluko, would you believe it? The veteran. 3-1. And that's it. Ipswich have won the league. We are champions of the championship. Unbelievable. But I am more happy for Aluko, who has just won us the championship for his final season in football. Has just won it. As you say, you do not lose skill. And he has shown that here. You might age, but he's still got that skill, Aluko. And he has shown that here. What a result here. And what a way to end off the season. 3-1. Great win. Our final game of the episode and of the championship is against Leicester City. And this is how our team looks. We've given um, Chaplin, who's literally just come back from his ACL injury. We're giving him the go here. He's ready to go. And I'm hoping he can do well for us, mate. So good seeing him back. Travis, potentially his final appearance for the club. Uh, we started him. Hadelki as well in net. Potentially his final appearance for the club as well. In um, gold, whose contract is at the end of the season. Kifo Moore, obviously, we're sticking up top still. Potentially his final uh, Ipswich game as well as Samantino, unless we do decide some of these guys. But we've already done it. You know, 50 league games here for Kieran McKenna. We've already done it. We're promoted, you know, to the uh, Premier League. But, you know, we always want to end off on a high. Let's take on Leicester. Okay, Leicester now lose the ball. Marcus Harness drills the ball in. Sarmentino hits the post. So close already to a fantastic start. Chance for Leicester. Shot blocked. Oh, it falls straight back to him and they drill the shot wide. Great chance for Leicester. A corner kick here to Leicester. Potentially the final chance of the half. 
I'm going to whip the ball in. Header. Oh, okay, that was dangerous. Half time, nil nil. Great going for San Mentino into more. Kifo more. Oh, just wide. Both teams, I don't know how on earth neither of us have scored. We've created so many good chances, but struggling to put that ball in the back of the net. Oh, chance here. Chaplin on his return to the side. He's been out for seven months and he doesn't look like he's missed a second. Let's go. Come on. One the lip switch. Chance here for Leicester, Mavidi. Drilled the ball across and Leicester have leveled it. 1-1. One, one. Harry Winks. Chance. Oh, Leicester have won it by the look of it. Harry Winks, despite, you know, our, you know, decent performance in this game so far. Leicester have won it. Not our best performance, but in the end, it doesn't really matter in a way. We are still champions, and it still has been an absolutely fantastic, you know, season so far with this Ipswich side. I really hope you guys have enjoyed uh, season one so far. It's a fantastic achievement here for us to win the league. Um, like I said, a bit of a better, you know, way to end it, you know, though, in terms of obviously a defeat, but... We are champions. Was tight. You know, we're competing with Norwich pretty much most of the season. You know, us and Norwich, firmly, we drop off a little bit. But we managed to hold our own and pick ourselves back up. Sam Morsi, the man who's made the most appearances for the club, you know, holds up the trophy. So happy for him, man. We've done so well, you know, this season. So well. And hopefully season two in the Premier League will be very good. Let me know if you guys enjoyed season one. We got a lot to get through in the next episode. Uh, so what we're going to do in the next episode, we're going to do a recap of everything. You know, go through player stats, go through where other teams finished, go through what position we should sign. We'll find out our budget. We'll go through our youth academy. We are champions. But yes, thank you all for watching. Have a great day, everybody. We've done it.